So piggybacking off of the, and this is probably the last topic we'll get to tonight, and uh, we'll look forward to covering a lot more topics here in the coming months, but so tournament fishing uh, lends itself, and just being a guide in general, we were talking about this before the, the camera was on, just boat etiquette in general, and um, there's a lot of new boat owners out there and, and guys that are first time tournament fishermen, and there's a lot of unwritten rules to boat etiquette, and uh, I just thought it would be interesting to get all of your guys' perspective on the do's and don'ts. Jeff, especially starting with you, I mean, you're a guy, you have to deal with it every day, and uh, with a lot of boat traffic, what, 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 if you had to pick a few do's and don'ts, what, what would you, what would you say? Oh, man, I mean, uh, you know, just, just that common courtesy, you know, don't crowd into somebody, I don't crowd in on anybody, mm -hmm. if I see, if I see somebody pulling in on a fence row, I'm not going to jump five trees ahead of them and, mm -hmm. and try to fix that. Where, when does crowding in stop? Is it 50 yards, 100 no, yards, I mean, that whole no entire bank? bank? You know. Yeah. You know, how close do you want me to you? Right. You know what I mean? Yeah. That's how close I want you to be. Mm -hmm. You know, um, that sort of thing. That's uh, a great statement. Know. I mean, if people mm -hmm. would think about that before they make the move, well, how would I feel if I was there and all of a sudden he pulled in yeah. 10 trees in front of me? Yeah. If they'll just think about that. Yeah. If it crosses your mind that, oh man, I think I'm yeah. going to make this. <laughs> 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 That's right. That's how it goes. Yeah. Or if you got to look over your shoulder, yeah. you know. Yeah. Right. And as a guy, dude, I want to hang out with everybody. I've talked to David 75 times on the water. Oh my gosh. Gosh. We've all the visited time. and everything yeah. else. But like sometimes I get people that come and they visit and they talk and they Ask a lot of questions, mm -hmm. and I got two clients in the boat. Like, who is this client? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, hey, dude, I'll call you tonight yeah. or something. Yeah. <laughs> and, and you're trying to do your job. Yeah, right. and it's not. I don't want to visit with you. I just, I got these two yeah. people here. They got, paid you. Yes, yeah. yeah. I kind of yeah. got to pay attention yeah. to you. Yeah. Like I said, we'll wheel over. Hey, dude, what's up, man? Mike's been good. Blah blah blah. And then see you later. Yeah, yeah. You know, that's it. You Ow. get, you get Ow. some. Ow. 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 And does it for a while, and you're like. Hey man, I, I gotta go, and I bless spots. Yeah, you know? and then and you know just social media is so bittersweet anymore. Mm -hmm. um, and I don't care if it's tournament fishermen, guide fishermen, you know, Dylan myself. You know, if if somebody comes over, and especially if it's two or three days in a row, um, you know, we'll get on a pattern, and if we're lucky, we can stick with it for a few days mm -hmm. with clients. And you know, if we get on a pattern and somebody sees us there two days in a row, mm -hmm. and they see our social media that we just pounded on them, yeah. um, <laughs> they're going to be up thirty minutes earlier than you are. Right. And that, you know, that's the nature of the piece. It's mm -hmm. the nature of, of of social media, and it's uh, it's changed the game a little mm -hmm. bit. But there's nothing you can really do about it. Mm -hmm. You adapt and overcome, like any good guy should. Yeah. Yeah. It's it's just what it is, man. Common courtesy. That's the main thing it boils down it to. It is. It is. Is there anything when it comes into tournament fishermen uh, with bass? I mean, I, yeah, I mean, I figured there's got to be some stuff specifically that would be Go ahead. Go ahead, to well, uh, If you're like uh, in the national championship in Florida last December and you find fish 300 yards offshore, and you would think 